How to fill SAW's logbook for civil engineering. If you're a civil engineering student in Nigeria, you're probably wondering how to fill out your SIW's logbook correctly. This logbook is a critical part of your internship experience, and getting it right can make a big difference in your final grade. First, let's talk about the structure of the logbook. It's designed to be filled out daily or weekly, so try to avoid procrastinating until the end of your program. Each page typically includes sections for the date, time in and out, and a space to record your daily activities. Start by filling in your personal details such as your name, registration number, the company you're working with, and their contact information. Then move on to the weekly activities section. Here, you'll have spaces for each day of the week, Monday to Friday or Saturday, depending on your work schedule. For each day, write a brief summary of what you did. For example, if you were involved in cement mixing, bonding, and laying blocks, note that down. If you worked on waterworks or learned about borehole installation, include those details as well. Keep it concise but make sure to capture the main points of your activities. Include the date and time you reported for work each day. This helps keep your logbook chronological and makes it easier to review your progress. If you have weekly assignments, you can summarize the activities done continuously over the week. Don't forget to draw diagrams of machines, structures, or equipment you use during the training. There's usually a section for this at the end of the week. Label these diagrams correctly so they are easy to understand. At the end of each week, take your logbook to your industry-based supervisor for their signature and comments. This is crucial because it verifies your work and provides feedback on your performance. Engage with your supervisor for mentorship. They can help you improve and broaden your knowledge. Maintain good English grammar and spelling. Read through what you've written to ensure there are no errors. This makes your logbook look professional and standard. The logbook also serves as proof of your SIW's experience, so filling it out diligently can help you remember key procedures and tasks you've undertaken. It contributes significantly to your final grade, with some institutions allocating up to 25% of the total grade to the logbook. Finally, ensure that all pages are signed and stamped by your supervisor. This validation is essential for the authenticity of your logbook and will help you avoid any penalties or issues when submitting your report. By following these steps, you will be able to fill your SIW's logbook effectively and make the most out of your internship experience. Remember, it's not just about filling out a book. It's about documenting your growth and learning as a civil engineering student.